when Avery won HOH, I was definitely hoping I was going to be safe and wouldn't even see the block. Um, in our initial conversations, she told me I didn't need to worry that Maze was good and I would not be put up. However, after seeing Tola win the power of veto, just doing the numbers in my head, I kind of realized there was a strong chance that I was an option to go up. And then when she pulled me aside that day and just seeing the look on her face and the tears starting right away, I knew there was a solid chance that I was going to be put up on the block. And just being a one of the physical threats in the house, I knew that the girls would take the opportunity to probably try to uh, send me home. And that's what happened. I feel like Spicy has um, a good control on the house right now, especially on the girls' side. I feel like she has some alliances spread out throughout the house. And then just looking at it from a long-term point of view, after she revealed that she's been working with Kayla, Avery, Dougie, and Lexis, um, I truly believe that Lexis and Dougie would have chose me over anyone in that alliance and possibly even in the house. I would have been their number one. So just looking from a long point of long term point of view, it was just best for her game, as well as she was right. We could have had more one on one game conversations. I just really trusted her when she gave me my her word, as well as I thought her relationship with Dougie would keep me safe. But it was probably the best for her game to send me home, to be honest. I don't think I would change anything. Uh, I definitely enjoyed my time in the house. But from a game perspective, I definitely could have had more one-on-one -on -one conversations with Avery, with Spicy, uh, even Kayla and Bailey, just on a game point of view, just so they felt my trust. However, the person I am, I'm very true to my word and I'm loyal. So it's really hard for me to bend the truth or lie and to tell someone I got them like that when I already had the people I was rocking with. I truly would have always stayed loyal to Lexus, Dougie, um, Tola and actually even spicy. I wouldn't have, I would have kept that final four and that final five all the way through. I probably would have put up Kayla and Bailey. Um, it didn't really matter which one went home to me just cause I knew both of them had definitely pitched for me to go up at one point in the game and were definitely okay with sending me home. I also think, uh, just having them both on the block there, it kind of, doesn't give them the chance for one of the others to like Kayla or Bailey to play in the veto competition. They're both strong competitors and to save the other. And then both of them are safe, if that makes sense. So I would definitely have put up Kayla and Bailey in the house. Lexus was definitely my like safe space and the place where I could feel like myself and just truly open up. Um, I don't do anything just for fun. I'm have a big heart. I'm true to my word. So everything I told her, I truly meant. I know that we're kind of cooped up in a not true reality world in the Big Brother house. So everything can feel amplified, but everything that I said and felt was real. So I definitely hope that we can try and see on the outside, but it takes two to tango. So I got to make sure that she's into that too. Regardless, I feel like I uh, have a lifelong friend and just gain someone in my life that I truly value. It definitely depends on who wins the next HOH. I'm hoping Tola can win it and put up two girls and send them packing. However, he's also in tough trenches right now. I know if anyone on that other side of the house wins, they're definitely sending him home, whether they put him up on the block or they try to backdoor him. He's definitely their number one target. So I'm hoping it's not him. And I hope it's one of the girls and I get my revenge.